Well, here I am. Um, I'm Curvy Calm. I'm a lamer. I suck. Behold these truths to be self-evident. Um, and lamer mistake one, I have my stream turned up. So, uh, Lamerville, USA, here you are. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm on my banker, but I, I already did the banking thing while I was working on some uh, chat-related stuff. I, I, I realize there's the reason to have the chat in the, uh, in the stream because um, when it's in the stream and uh, uh, when it's in the stream and someone types something, you know, like this, then at least you got some continuity. Uh, Plaguey's chirping back at me. Uh, and, uh, yeah, at least you have some continuity, uh, in the stream so that if you wonder what in the world someone asked you when you answered a question or when you said something, or you just laughed and, and, you know, at least there's like a little bit of a, of a record and you can kind of see what's on there. It stays up for 15 seconds. I'm not sure, uh, like, I'm not sure what the best color is. I've tried white and white doesn't look so good, so I tried a white bright yellow and I don't really know I, I maybe I should try like a desaturated yellow or something but I don't know whatever you do it's like if it's too bright then it doesn't you know you can't see it over white and then if it's too dim you really you can't see it over uh, um, can't see it over uh, it's too dark you can't see it over really black dark stuff so you know I don't know they don't have a uh, Streamlabs doesn't have like an anti-alias or, or rote 13 or not rote 13, but you know, like uh, doesn't have a not uh, um, not gate color. You know, that would be good, actually, if they had that. And uh, so, yeah, I'm thinking uh, I'm thinking that uh, uh, it'd probably be best to, uh, I'll just leave it as it is for now and we'll see how it goes. Uh, maybe white would be better. I don't know. I could change it, but in any case, uh, I've tried, I can try different styles. Uh, I want to try things that are pretty visible, but, uh, maybe I have my font too big right now. I don't know. I'm not really sure. Uh, if it's too small, I can't see it, you know, on my small monitor over up there. And, uh, um, so, yeah, I don't know, I'm just, uh, uh, yeah, so, uh, anyone, anyone who knows, uh, anyone who knows, uh, and I can read the chat down here, you know, on the, I can read the chat down there on the, on the, uh, the fake laptop, and, uh, so, but it's, uh, it's just, uh, um, yeah, I, it's just, uh, uh, sort of, I don't know what I'm, what am I saying? I'm saying nothing, evidently. I've already done my auctioning stuff, so I think I'm going to just, uh, I'm just sitting here dancing in the auction house because that's what I often do at the beginning of a stream. And, uh, you know, I was watching Skirmy, uh, um, play. Skirmy and I had a real fun time playing World of Warcraft in, in, uh, the panda starting zone. So we both started a panda and, uh, and kind of leveled, uh, he showed up at some point and actually I decided to, on a, the spur of the moment to do it. And then he showed up and we like streamed for seven hours or something, or I did total. And I think he was like on for maybe five of that for the end. And, uh, and, uh, Gianti, uh, is now hosting the stream. Thank you very much, Giant, for the host. Uh, 
Do I have you on my auto host or 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 not? I think I do, but if I don't, I will add you to my auto host. Um because that is a thing. Let's see, I, I, I might have to refresh this page here to see if uh see if you show up. It takes a little while sometimes to show up. So something's coming up here. Uh, no, it doesn't show you yet, but it will. It will at some point. It, I don't know how. This is not like this says live. So the Twitch dashboard it says live. So I think you might not have to refresh it, but uh, uh, I'm I'm not sure actually. So we'll wait till it shows up. Then I can just click a single button and put you on my list too. So I don't know. I'm refreshing it anyway, but it's not. It's not showing up yet. All right. Well, I'll wait. I'll wait a little while longer, and should show up at some. Point. So sometimes it takes a few minutes. So, uh, um, yeah. I I. Uh, I'm going to refresh it again and see what happens here. Oh, not yet. Anyway, uh, so uh, thanks for the host. Um, I uh, am just standing here doing whatever here. I'm not really actually doing anything right now because uh, I'm just hanging out. I had so much fun playing a panda. I wanted to call her Amanda Panda, but I didn't because, you know, obviously that would not be available. And, uh, and, uh, so, uh, I called her Zhao Xing Yu or something like that. It's very, it was a, it was a pretty nice, uh, Chinese ish sounding name. I'm sure it's not a real name because I just used the auto generate and then changed a few things. And, uh, so, you know, I hope it doesn't mean bite the wax tadpole in Chinese or something, but you know, it might. <laughs> so I don't really know. Um, I'm like uh, streaming at like 1640 bitrate and uh, that's doing pretty good considering we're in prime time. It's not, uh, it's not in the red right now. So that's something. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do here. I guess I'm just going to log into my Druid and do stuff. Um, I tried to, uh, I tried to, to, uh, read a guide as to where the dailies were, uh, yesterday. And I discovered I was too much of a lamer to do that. So evidently I got like the one that had the most of the horde quests in it. Some of them are different. So, um, so I didn't really, I wasn't really sure. So in any case, uh, um, so... I guess I'm just, uh, I'm just kicking back here. I feel like, uh, I feel like my monitor is too loud. That's, that's the usual thing because I turn it up when I'm doing experiments. Anyway, so now I got chat in here. So if I lamer ban myself, uh, it should show that. <laughs> so there you go. Uh, Lamer Van Kirby Com 600 minutes. No reason given. No explanation possible. No action taken. You will never know why this happened. There you go. So now I think it starts to fade out in a moment or two. Uh, I think it's 50. It's like I turned it up a little bit from 15 seconds because it gives me a chance to. Uh, uh, and yeah, boy. Thank you for the lurk. We got lurks. We got all kinds of things going on in this channel. It's dizzying. It's a dizzying amount of things that happen in the channel. So, uh, um, yeah, I, I guess, um, I guess, uh, yeah, they fade out after a little while. I've got different, there's different, um, uh, there's different, uh, uh, themes you can do like a real plain uh, twitch looking chat theme or 
or whatever. I, I don't know. I, I didn't really... I thought maybe a plain Twitch looking thing would be better. But I didn't do that right away. And uh, I just, uh, I kind of picked one that had bigger print natively. And so, uh, uh, yeah, boy, you're too cool to be in my lamer zone in a big way. But, you know, it's nice to have you anyway. So I guess, uh, I guess I'll just go back to, uh, to Pandaria. I love playing the panda. It was fun. It was really fun. And they have a funny dance, too. The girl pandas, any well, they both do. They're both uh, they're both funny. Plaguey looked up the uh, the the source of the dances for me, so I actually have a little email that tells me what they are. And uh, um, And you know, if anyone out there knows anything about like people that get banned from a channel without it being intended and how to rectify that, because evidently when that happens, unban doesn't work. Uh, and I don't know, like, I don't know what's causing that, like uh, one person it happened to. And uh, like it happened to me in someone's channel and it just could be one of those things where, where you know, like I said, I don't even know. I still lurk in that guy's channel, but it always says I'm banned from talking. And since I never hardly talked in that channel, I can't imagine what, you know, I couldn't have possibly said anything because, I mean, the most I've ever said was lurk. So, and I know he has other lurkers, so it's not like uh, that made him mad or something. So, in any case, uh, so that's, that's kind of where the lamer ban idea came from. You know, you just get banned for being a lamer and you have no idea why. And, you know, these things happen, you know. Uh, um, so, uh, I don't know. If I was going to do a stream, if I was going to do a Twitch tutorial, since I am a lamer and I suck and I don't actually know enough about Twitch to do a tutorial, um, one thing I would do, I could do, is I could draw from my understanding of human nature and uh, just talk about like soft subjects like you know don't jump to conclusions when someone unfollows you or something um, 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 don't send them a nasty message uh, because you have no idea why it happened it's possible that nothing happened so I can't do I have no buffs man someone's hitting me with uh, paladin buffs and uh, it's awesome Uh, so, I'm gonna, I'm gonna log out of this character and, uh, and, uh, go back to, uh, go back to, uh, Alesa in the Valley of the Four Winds. She's got her antlers and her, and her magic staff with growing stuff on it. It seems to have caught on fire, but, uh, you know... Um, that seems like it might be a little alarming, but in any case, uh, she's there. She's, uh, I think she has a thing for Malfury and Storm Rage. And, you know, it could just be, it could just be, uh, you know, hero worship, uh, but it, you know, it could be more than that. You never know, really. And so, uh, here we are once again and, and oh my gosh, it's raining out there. I love the rain, although I don't like walking around in it so much, but you know, since I'm not actually going to get wet doing it. Oh, look at that. Look at that little guy. Explorers League. This little gnome tweets light sprocket. She just walks around here. She's got like a like a brew fest hat or something. And she's got a little bottle of something. I don't know. She's got the brew fest mug. Explorers League. Tweets light sprocket. Wow. Okay. She's a little adorable little thing too. Uh um, so it looks like there's some kind of thing here. What's this? Please uh, browse my wares. A shabby new face? This is new. What's this? A strange fellow in a pointy hat showed up this morning trying to sell me some kind of special seeds. Claimed they were magic. 
Oh no. Okay. I welcome a little competition. Business is business after all, but this gentleman had a certain shabby look to him. Oh, and he stunk something fierce. Would you check up on him just to make sure he's on the level? He's over there by Jan Iron for Paw, making a meal out of the samples. Jay okay. Well, that's very interesting. Uh, it's a washed up mage. He's the guy, the washed up mage, hey Bar Barnaby Fletcher. Fletcher. He sh he's like the one that, he's the one that, 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 that gives you the Congaloosh potion. Is that, is that Congaloosh? So you can make Congaloosh sauce. And, uh, um, and, ha ha ha, Plaguey. Yeah, you know, I don't know. I walk in the rain. I like to walk in the rain with an umbrella. Um, you know, I, 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 I get, you know, I haven't done this in a long, long time, but I like to put on my three-piece suit and get my umbrella and walk like I'm an Englishman in New York, you know, like the song goes. And, uh, but I haven't done that in a while, you know, and we don't have a lot of rain up here either, but, you know, it's, it's a thing. I, I got to find out what this washed up mage is all about. What's going on here? He's making a little meal. Good day to you. Uh, this is new. Ahum, um, no, slurp. Oof. Okay, he says. Uh, Barnaby looks up from the table, revealing a tangled beard dotted with melon seeds. He's eating melon. Juices rush down his chin as he greets you. Okay, hmm, cough. A customer, hello, name's Fletcher. Barnaby Fletcher. Nice to meet you. Okay. He wipes, his, he wipes a hand on his robe before extending it, still visibly sticky and flecked with pulp. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right. And what? Okay. What's going? What's going to happen now? I do not want to buy your magic beans. Four months magic free, and it feels great. Oh, you're trying. <laughs> yeah. I don't think it's magic that you have to kick the habit of. You know. Uh, four months magic free, and it feels great. He says. Okay. Who needs the infinite mystery of the arcane when you got fresh fruit and hot tea like this? Oh, I'm getting suspicious here. All right. Before we enter into a business relationship, I, I'm required by the terms of my rehabilitation program to inform you that I am a recovering potion addict. Well, who said anything about a business relationship? You know, I didn't bring that up. I just said hello, you know. I mean, um, aren't you jumping to conclusions? Um, there. Now that that's out of the way, let's talk portals. Or how about let's not talk portals? How about that? How about let's not talk portals at all? Um, you see, the big portals in the cities, the ones running all day and night, leak tons of magical energy. It crystallizes around the edge and is generally regarded as trash. But I noticed during my uh, hiatus in the sewers of Dalaran, he was passed out there. <laughs> it is the same guy during my hiatus in the sewers of Dalaran that these shards still had power. Interested? I, you know, I don't really think... I, I, I don't like where this is going. But he says, interested. I want an unstable portal shard. Use. Plant the unstable portal shard. Chaotic arcane energy crystallized from high traffic portals. The soil of Sunsong Ranch will stabilize this energy, yielding a shard that can be broken on the farm to open a one-shot portal to a major city. Really? Okay, well, that's a very interesting. So, uh, all right. Well, all right. I, I, I have misgivings, let's just say. I have misgivings about this. And uh, um, I just do. I just have some misgivings here about this. So, all right. I accept. I have a feeling I'm going to regret it. I knew you would be. Oh, now what? Here's the catch. Oh, here be the, here be the catch. Yeah, the shards in their current state are unstable, but the soil in this valley is renowned for its magical properties. Yeah, I know you get like these 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 uh, these 300 pound carrots. Uh, I am sure if you were to plant the shard, and a very interesting reaction would take place. It could stabilize, leaving you with a functional portal, or it might tear open a magical rift that spits out. Transdimensional horrors. 
My gut tells me it will be a little of both, but there's only one way to know for sure. Well, you know, don't let it never, never let it be said that I'm a druid that, that, that doesn't enjoy tossing caution to the winds. So here, take a sample. I don't know if I want this, but you That's know, what the hey, I got a sample. Now, what do I do now? Um, so uh, I've got a sample. It's a shard. I can plant it. Do I plant it in my own farm or where do I plant this thing? I got a sample and then that's it. Barnaby Fletcher, I think I like you better when you were just on the Kungaloosh. That's what I think. I think, you know, maybe just brew up some Kungaloosh and uh, uh, take a chill pill. Sit down somewhere. This is like, let me introduce you to, uh, yeah, Barnaby, let me introduce you to, to, uh, to Jogu over here, you guys could just kind of chill out and and drink some of the good stuff. I think that would probably be better than than what you are proposing. What does Jogu Listen want here? To the river. A dish for Jogu. I can give you something. A good meal. I got I got carrots. You can have carrots. You love them. Okay. May your pools be ever full. And oh, now I think I just what changed uh, my. Life? Buy a fish a keg. He wants a keg? My dreams grow dim recently, Night Elf. I need something powerful to kick myself back into gear. I heard there's a delicious drink that folks are making nowadays. It's called Jade Witch Brew. I sure like to taste some. Okay. I want to taste that. It sounds really the good. Okay. Jade. Okay. But I understand these guys now. You know, these guys, uh, these, uh, Jogu, he has a, it's a heavy burden on him because, you know, he, uh, he has visions. The river gives him visions. And, you know, um, it's, it's, it's a heavy, it's a heavy load to carry. So, you know, I, I, I don't blame him for wanting to dull the senses a little. Um, speak up. Water, water everywhere. Okay, Mr. Watering Guy. Okay, I need some water out the crops in the... I want you to water all the crops. Okay, get the kite from Wing Naga. Okay, I, I, go I like that. You. I like that quest. Ella! Hello. What can I do for you, Ella? Um, you have to burn... Oh, this again. You have to burn the ropes. Okay, she wants me to burn the ropes and uh, not kill all the monkeys. All right. I know it's a stupid idea. <sighs> Ella, it is a stupid idea, but I'm not going to tell you that. I'm not going to tell you that. The monkeys are going to keep coming regardless of what I do to their ropes. But, uh, problematics. I'm doing something. Young chap. <laughs> you do know I'm almost 60, right? Uh, okay. <laughs> All right, uh, I'm doing fine. I, I, I guess I should have had the text to speech on for a little while because I didn't see you there. And and you know, once the chat gets a little more lively, I see more, like I see it more. But uh, anyway, let's see. Ella, she just wants me to burn. No, it was a silly I idea believe. anyway. No, I'm, I'm. It's not a silly idea to be a good person, Ella. That's what I want you to take away from this, really. I, it's not a silly idea to be a good person. And you are a good person. You have a big heart. And, Tell me you know, that's problems. what matters. So, you want me to go burn some ropes? I'll do it. I, I, I'm dubious about the success of that project. But, you know, I'm going to do it anyway. I'll do it for you. So, let's see. We're talking about some... Uh, oh, yeah, you need meat with better... Shaghorns. You need meat with better fat. You pat your voluminous belly. I can't, like, it's not in camera. It's not very voluminous, but could be less voluminous, I'm going to say. You know, I don't know. I've been, like, uh, going to the gym more lately, but I haven't gone in the last like several days. So, protect. and I haven't, I haven't gone. I did some push-ups. I haven't gone since the last time I uh, got back from the trip to Phoenix. So... I guess it's been more than just a few days. It's been it's been a number of days. All right, Hi there. and uh, you know, 
I like streaming on soon. Twitch. I like doing that, I gotta tell you, because I like having something to do. And, you know, it doesn't just feel like work, it is work, because there's, like, lots of stuff to do. And, uh, um, maybe I should make it, like, make a little noise when there's chat. Let me see. Let me see. Can I do that? It'll go beep. That won't be too disruptive on the screen if it, on the stream, if it goes beep every time a chat thing comes in. And I don't, yeah, I don't think the chat widget has that as a, let me see about that. Does the chat widget have a sound thing? It doesn't. The chat widget itself, no sound associated with that. That's kind of too bad. Wait, I got to look more carefully. Okay, show ter shows a bunch of things. Enable better TTV emotes. I don't know what those things are. And the Franker face emotes. I don't know if I check that, if you have to have Franker face, uh, Franker faces uh, um, plug in also, or I really don't know. I, maybe if I check them, something horrible won't happen. Let me do that, actually. <laughs> Quite possible that nothing bad will happen when I do that. Okay. I'll, I'll type, uh, let's see, I'll type YouTube. And, uh, um, there we go. And, uh, okay. And that is, that's, that's pretty legible anyway, but it doesn't make any noise. So, uh, I'm gonna, well, of course it won't when, when I type anyway, but let me see. Uh, if I go to my settings on, uh, if I go to my settings on, on, um, on the Twitch client and I look at my, Um, I look at my notifications. Okay, let's see. Uh, I just want to... No, this is not... Oh, in-game? In-game? What's this? Oh, in-game is nothing. Game-specific. In-game overlay. Allows a Twitch in-game overlay with compatible games. Oh, you know what? Oh, I don't have any idea. I don't have any idea. Diablo 3, there's an in-game overlay, but I, yeah, I, I, okay, there's a special thing for Minecraft, I never tried that, maybe I should try that, but in any case, notifications, let's see here, see how this works, message from a friend, make a sound, all right, I have to turn on sounds, okay, when I receive notifications, play a sound, all right, and there's a sound, there's a thing. Okay, now, message. See what that's going to sound like. I oh, it won't, it won't, it won't show me what it sounds like. Okay, friends, re friend requests enabled. Uh, friend suggestions. Friend comes online. Uh. All right. Well, obviously, this will not do anything. Okay, sounds. When I receive a notification, play a sound. Mute notification sounds when I'm playing a game. This will not actually be helpful. This is not like a... This is not a... Friend starts playing a game. Message from a friend. Uh, what does it say? Favorite friends only, never... Okay, I mean, this is does not... This is not what I want. I just want from... I just want a... Uh, I just want a thing that... I just want a thing that tells me when there's a chat message. I, you know, probably could do that on, on IRC. If I have like, I've got like, uh, all right, let's have a look at this. So I've got, of course, the voice thing, but notification sounds, I bet this probably has that. So let me have a look. It's going to get real bright here all of a sudden, because I'm going to bring up this big window that is really white. All right, I can make it a little smaller, but all right, this this thing here is, uh, and you know I've got made a YouTube command so that it's not always you know like being spat out during the lurk thing, but basically the reason I have that up there is I don't use my, I don't use my uh, hey thanks problematics for the lurk, um I don't use the um, uh, I don't use my YouTube's 
channel for anything except for archiving my old streams. So I kind of say, well, if I'm if you're a history buff, you can uh, you can get older streams there. And if you want to if you want a good laugh, you can watch my first stream. You know that would be that would be a thing you could do. Um, I had no idea what I was doing. I mean, I still kind of don't, but um, if I don't now, man, if you think about it, you know, really. Think about how it was that first day. You know, it's, uh, um, I've even thought about roasting that stream, you know, like streaming that and commenting over it. But it's so boring, I think, that it doesn't even have... I mean, all I would be doing is just making fun of how boring it is at the beginning. But um, let's see. So I was looking for notifications, right? Is that is that right? And then let me see. Uh, I want to see, like, uh, um, see, this does have, like, notifications, like, uh, oh, let me see how this works. Flashing, logging, position, space, and speech, tips. Is there events? Events. What are events? Okay, these are events that are hidden. Uh, and uh, I don't know. Uh, Uh, so I don't know. I'm, I'm like, I don't know here what's up with this. So let me see. Uh, I gotta, I gotta look at what are some of the commands here I can use. And, uh, So, yeah, I'm kind of looking at, okay, so uh, options. Let me see what the options are. So there are sounds, okay, except sound requests. These are sounds. These are not notification sounds. Oh, my gosh. So uh, basically there's speech, but I swear there were, like, notifications in this program. Display options, DCC, S direct client to client. Um, uh, other things. Okay, let me see. Flood fill, flood fill prevention, flood prevention, uh, connect the options. Yeah, I don't think there's a way to, uh, I don't think this has a little beep for receiving sound, or maybe there is. I don't know. Actually, I don't know. Uh, I don't, I don't see that there is, I, there's, it can do sounds though. It can do text to speech, sound requests, listen for Nick file, get requests. Uh, yeah, I just don't know. I, I don't know. Uh, okay. So I guess, uh. I guess I'll have to find another solution to this. That's it's not a thing. It's not a thing for me to do right now. Um, okay, so let's see. What have I done? Have I done all these guys over here? I'm gonna I'm gonna pick this up. Hello. Okay. I reckon there just ain't enough hours in the day. Okay. Guns and Hunter Chief. Okay. See, this is already. I can't tell, uh, I can't tell, um, Ella there that I'm going to kill like some monkeys, Next one, you know, me. I think I'll just have to preserve her innocence by not telling her, you know, the full extent of my mission, my mission objectives. Uh, so the pink turnip challenge. Okay. I know about that. The pink turnip challenge. I can plant a pink turnip. I'm probably going to get pink turnip seeds when I get this. Okay. Red blossom leek, carrot, and carrot, and carrot, 
wonder what happens when you leave these weeds. I wonder if they turn into this big mess. Uh, there's a stubborn weed. I can like pull on this thing. I can pull and pull it out. It's pulled out now. All right. So uh, now one thing I got to do is I got to find, let me see what I got in my bags here. So I've got, oh, I've got a blue feather. How did I get that? I, that came from, that came from the, the soil, I guess. And uh, all right, unstable portal shard. I can plant this. Is that is that really is that true? Um, see how I have no idea. Um, and uh, let's see. Uh, all right, I'm gonna see what. Oh yeah, it's planting the portal shard. Unstable portal shard. What am I supposed to do? Oh man, this has got to be a rift stalker. All right, I'm gonna poke you with my stick, rift, rift, rift stalker. It's gonna put the titan thing on you too, and and you're gonna be sorry that you're attacking me because I'm gonna I'm gonna stick you with my stick. Okay. All right. And uh, so that's that. Okay, now it says portal shard. So that just grows. I'm going to let that grow, I guess. Maybe I should have put it back here in case it explodes. Should have put it back here. That would have been sensible, maybe. All right. All right. Oh, wait. There's another thing here. What's this? Welcome. Oh, Farmer Fung's vote. One. Yak attack. Oh, okay. We want Farmer Fung to vote for us so that we can join the Tillers. Okay. Next one is on me. All right. Very good. I don't know why that just popped up just now, but uh, I got to plant, what, a pink turnip? And I bet you I have that seed, right? I don't. Don't I? I got no seeds this time. I got no seeds. I got carrots. And that's it. I got nothing. Okay, you usually get a few seeds when you harvest, so I guess this time not. All right, so, uh, all right, I'll get some seeds. That'll be great. Looking to buy? And they're pink turnip seeds. I'll get one. There's and more. Farmer Fung, are you gonna support me for your for my entrance into the tillers. Let's see what he what has do you to need? say. Oh, and a blue feather for Farmer Fun. I can give him a blue feather. Sure, what the heck. Hey, how do you do, Night Elf? Have a blue feather. Oh, this is a very rare blue feather. Thank you. Okay. Goodbye. All right. And now I've got, like... He considers me an acquaintance, so that's kind of nice. Okay. So, uh... And Farmer Fun, what else does he like? Uh... Wild, wild fowl roast. Okay. All right. Now. Oh, you're that new farmer in town, aren't you? All right. You may. You want my vote for farmer Yoon? Ha ha ha! You're joking, right? Listen, I'm not gonna vote for some city paw with no lick of knowledge about farming the earth. It would be an embarrassment to farm alongside you or that Yoon schmuck. Well, fine. That's a little. That's a little. Um, that's a little harsh, isn't it? Now let me deal with my own problem. Some devil let me let my prize yaks loose, and now they're running wild northwest of Half Hill. If I could just get my yaks back, then maybe I'd be able to sleep at night. Is that a, is that a huge hint? Until okay. next time. I'm going to help you with your yaks. I'm going to help. I'm going to help out, and it's going to be all right. It's going to be all right. I Don't worry. Don't worry at all. No worries. All right. That really is... I should have put that all the way back there where you know, when it exploded. Okay. So, uh, here's a thing. It's a bursting pink turnip. What do I do when it's bursting? Oh, I harvest it right away. Is that right? 
Well, that was interesting. Okay. Hello. Okay. All right. It just it just came right out. Okay, came right out right away. Amazing, magical soil. Okay, that doesn't usually happen. I guess I could plant some carrots. Let me put them back here. I got like, or what do I have? Oh, I have turnip seeds, pink turnip seeds now. And do I have any carrot? I got a carrot. Okay, let's do, let's do. This will be riveting stuff. I might as well do this. Okay, let's see. So here's a carrot. And it's runty. I can pull it up. And, uh, uh, here's, here's a vermin. Yeah. Get away, vermin. Get away. I'm going to hit you with my stick. I'm going to hit you with my lame night elf moonfire that doesn't do much damage, too. My stick does more damage than that thing. Okay. And, uh, all right. There's a bit of untilled soil. I got how many I need? I've got three turnip seeds. I can that right. Is that that? It's about right. I can till some soil here. It's a lot of work. This farming, isn't it? Okay. Let's see what happens. Oh no! <laughs> All right. All right. How do I do this? Uh. All right. Okay. Bite the vine. Interrupts the vine slap. Okay. I'm gonna bite the vine. Okay. I can interrupt the vine slap. Okay, did I get it? I got it. It's gone, okay? It's much better now. Um, and here's another seed. And it is what? Parched, okay? Parched. I can water it. It would be much better. And it's now... Now it's just fine. Okay, and... Uh, all right. And it is uh, tangled, so let's just pull this sucker out. Oof! Okay. Hurt a little, but, you know, it's done now. Okay, so I got all these plots. I don't know what to do. I've got this mysterious portal seed growing here. I'm not sure what's going to happen with it. Magical soil, portals, it's all very suspicious. But, uh, I don't know, Barnaby did teach me how to make Kungaloosh, so he probably doesn't remember that, but, uh, he was pretty drunk, so at the time, and, uh, so he might not be steering me wrong, probably, it's quite possible nothing bad will happen. You know, think of playing a game for 11 years or so. You know, I, I've never had a, a Hearthstone incident. Never had an incident where something, like I used my Hearthstone and something horrible happened. So, you know, portals can be very, very stable. So, you know, no need for worry. No need at all. No need for worry at all. Okay, so, um, this is, I really, you know, it's funny. These are daily quests, and daily quests can be monotonous, but I'm just finding this a lot, like, really fun for some reason. Like, I really like the... Okay, I think we'll do the watering thing next. See how that goes. What? What have I done here? There we go. Uh, Tell all right. Me of your travels. And I'd like to borrow one of Far Farmer Fung's kites. Farewell. All right, I'm doing it. I'm borrowing Farmer Fung's kites. This is fun. I like these. This is like uh, any of the kind of bombing runs that, that they have in the game. Are pretty fun. So 
we're going down here. We're gonna looking for looking for parched land. And you don't really have to like. I, I know it's got the um, it's got the thing with uh, um, it's got the thing with the um, that you can go back home. But as soon as you get enough for the quest. I've got watering arms, he says. He likes the way I toss those buckets. Oh, I could have, like, just tossed one bucket there. That would have probably been good. Did I get it? Got it. Let's see. Where am I headed next? I gotta do 35. There's a parched area. And there's, like, a big uh, hole there, too. Well, I think I might be able to get two and one there. Did I get two and one? I don't know. I have no idea. This has got to be a two and one, right? Did I get it? That's right. Did I get it? I did. Two and one. That's pretty fancy. I tried for a three and one once, but I don't think I got it. Watering arms. Okay. This is a huge farm here. What? Okay. Gotta be getting close, right? A lot of farms with giant, giant uh, vegetables on them. And other things. Oh, look, there's some soil. Oh, it's all over the place. That's one good reason to, I guess, go looking around for the soil. There's like the, there's like the, uh, the dark soil and you can get stuff from it. And I suppose I could be looking around for that. Okay, I did it. Uh, kind of, I'm kind of seeing some, uh, some frame droppage, but I don't know. You know, I mean, it's like, it's kind of... It's kind of up and down. It seems like it's mostly okay, so I'm going to leave it work for now. Okay, work complete. <clears throat> okay, here I am, back again. I think we're going to go back over here. All right. So. Okay, I've done that one. I guess I'll just turn it in now. Slow down. I, I guess at this point, nobody's alarmed for me turning into a giant bird. Now you'd think that would alarm Enough some people that. here that have never seen a druid before, but I guess they're all kind of used to me and my and my and my foreign ways, my mysterious foreign ways. No, at this point. So, I kind of wanted to uh, like go back up to the farm there. I just saw like. Uh, Oh, here's those things. Those are the escaped thingies. And, uh, so, like, when we, I was flying around this big farm. See, there's, like, mysterious dark soil. And if you look around, it's kind of like the eggs, you know, really. Hard to spot, but you oh, there's like a lot of it here. Okay, That's a lot of stuff. Now I know I saw some up here. Hereabouts, yeah. Here's one. Blue feather. Flying around looking at the soil. Trying to spot something. Dark soil. Looking for the dark soil. This is just gorgeous. I would totally live here, you guys. This would be awesome. This as long as I figured out how to way to get a way to get internet. You know, that, with that one caveat, I would say.
Oh yeah, there's Chi Chi. So I'm gonna turn. Oh, so Chi Chi, I probably have to talk to after I do this. Uh, after I do this, this, this thing, because Chi Chi is like. Oh look at that! I can give a blue feather to Chi Chi. Okay. Oh, so you can give them a whole bunch of stuff, not just two things, whatever he likes. And I can give him a jade cat. I'll give him a jade cat. And I'll give him a lovely apple. What the hey? I've found all these things. And he's happy now. I've given him these things. Okay. So, uh... Yeah, I don't know. I'm looking for dark soil. I'm not seeing any more, but I'm not sure where to look, you know. It, they could be anywhere. I mean, I find it randomly out in the world. So... These mogus here, are, these mogu are elites up here. Then there's a rare. I don't know, they never really drop anything that's all that useful. So, I mean, that's kind of one of the problems with the bothering to attack them, is... To, he managed to summon his whatever guild of, you know, don't stand in the purple goo. What did I get? Gloves of Burrow Spelunking? Is this a, uh, mines when picked up? All right. Leather gloves. Yeah, these better than the ones I have. I bet they're not. But let's have a look here. Okay. 21 armor, 25 agility, 38 stamina, haste and mastery. It really doesn't matter, does it? It doesn't matter. I don't care. So these are these are BOP. At least they're leather, you know, that's what I'm supposed to have. So Alright. So that's fine. Those will I can sell those for eight gold, so that's a thing. And, uh, I don't know now, let's see, over here, get the, uh, get the yaks that have broken loose or gotten loose somehow. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of mostly, uh, Oh, where am I? I? I This is where I'm supposed to. Now, what am I supposed to do? Am I supposed to ride these guys or what? Looks like something. Okay, get on the yak and go which way? Go to... Recover them to... Recover them where? Okay, hang on. I better find out. Uh, on the loose. Okay. Return five escaped shag skins to Farmer Fung's yak herd at the very north of the Verdant Belt. What's, where's the Verdant Belt? It's the Heartland. Oh, that's probably where it is. It's probably right here. Is this it? Okay. So I think all I have to do is ride him up into here, I'll bet. All right. Well, there's no gate. I can't close the gate, so it's not really helping anyone, probably. But okay. Well, we can just ride the axe up here. Makes me want strawberry quick now. So that's all I'm saying.
Okay. Ride him back in there. That's all you have to do. Okay. And... There's another one. I can ride it back. How fast does it go? It goes 114. It's better than nothing. Okay. Here are the yaks. All right, so let's see what's the uh, what's the story here. It looks like I'm turning it in to someone up there. Who am I turning this into? This is like uh... oh, I see. He's not here. He's back at this is marked over here, but he's actually back at Half Hill. Yeah. So he's oh look, Fung's note. He left me a note. All right, look at this. All right, gone to Half Hill Market. Don't touch my vegetables, okay? I know he's at he's at Half Hill Market, so that's where he is. Okay. Okay, Half Hill Market's down here. All right. And Mark, it's just here, right? We're, we're uh, oh no, right over here. Okay, hey, yeah. All right, so, uh, all right. I'm a giant bird, but it doesn't really alarm anyone at this point. So, uh, mm -hmm. uh, a gift for fun. What, what's this all about? Harumph. Check objectives. What is it? Grilled planes hawk leg. Right. Okay. Right. I don't know. He's good. Okay. Farmer Fung. Speak up. Let's see. Farmers Fung's vote on the loots. Okay. I did this. I did this for you. Farmer Fung stares at you with his jaw on the floor. I I can't believe you recovered all my prize shag skins. But you do you know what this means to me? My family's only been good at two things: raising enormous vegetables and raising yaks. Shagskins, you see, are a result of generations of work. You saved my family's legacy, Elisa. Okay. And... Enough of that. Enough of that. Now, Farmer Fung's vote, number three. Crazy for cabbage. Okay. Farmer Fung is beaming with a radiant smile. Thanks to you, I got my precious yaks back. Unfortunately, I noticed their time out in the wild has left them rather gaunt. They must be starving. But I don't feed my prize yaks just any regular old grass. No, sir. They eat only the leafiest green cabbages you can find here in the valley. My stores are a bit low. If you bring me some cabbages for my yaks, I will reward you handsomely. Okay, I now I could go buy time. those. I could go buy those, or I could just plant them. So maybe I'll just Probably plant them. Take your time. Because that's Enjoy. cheaper. Uh, how many cabbages does he need? He needs, uh, oh, he needs plant three and harvest three cabbages. So I got to plant at least three. So green cabbage seeds. Where are they? There they are. Okay. One, two, three. All right. I can do that. I can, I can do this, you guys. I can do this. All right. Okay, and cabbage seeds, I'll put them right here. All right, can't do that in kitty form. Kitty, kitty form. Okay, here's another one. All right. All right, so, uh,. Okay, I got my cabbage seeds. They're probably here somewhere. Where are they? Not in this bag. Are they in this bag? They're in this bag. So, yeah. All right. Cabbage seeds in the tilled soil. Okay, they're strangled or tangled. All right, there we go. Pull, 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 pull. 
All right, very good. And uh, one cabbage. Here's another. Oh, and there's a... Okay, well, if you insist, you little guy, I'm gonna get, like, slashed. Okay, you're slashed. Okay, little vermin. Uh, one more cabbage. And it is runty. Okay, I could do that in kitty form, I guess. And, uh, alright, so there's some... There's some cabbages. It's done. I've planted three cabbages. Very nice. Okie dokie. And uh, now that I've done that, what what next? What's uh, oh harvest? I have to harvest them. So if I harvest them, and uh, then that's tomorrow. So good Lord will in the creek don't rise, etc. Do that tomorrow. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, I probably got to do some monkey related things. There's usually there's usually monkeys involved in these quests. Uh But I don't know. We'll see what we got here. First of all, we have to go over here and do what? Oh, grilled plains hawk. I can kind of get those from up here. Uh, am I in range of this thing? I got one. Okay, there's one targeted. All right. And that's really all I need, right? It's just one of those, right? Isn't that true? Uh, I've got to get a good leg, though. I don't have one. Okay. I am not in range of these guys. All right. Better zoom out here. Here's... Well, I guess I could do it like this, too. Will he attack me if I get close to him? Well, evidently, not especially. And, like, mess around with him here, but I guess not, really. What am I supposed to do with these guys? All right. Did I get anything? All right. I know I'm not gonna. Oh hey. And I can't. If I get into combat, if I can't, I'll drop like a rock and I'll die. So let's see. We're. We're flying around all over the place, but. Yeah, I know, out of range. Let me see. Maybe I'm going, maybe I'm trying in the wrong place here, typically. Let's see. Plains hawks, leg. Okay. I know there's plains hawks over here, too. I don't think any of these are going to, I don't think they follow you. I mean, that's kind of a thing that you can't, like, they do not attack you. They do not follow you. Okay, let's see. So that really, that does not work very well at all. So I think I kind of have to, uh... Oh, have I gotten one? I've gotten one already. Okay, I see. I just have to grill it. All right. Lamer mistake. Okay, I... Okay, I guess I suck. What's this? Okay, a dish for... What does the he want? Of this buy a fish... Oh, buy a fish a keg. Right, that's a thing. What? Any luck? Let me see. I'm supposed to be getting him a jade witch brew. How do I do that? Do I 
Do I cook that? Known to cause massive headaches, it says. All right. So, uh, Greetings, well, wanderer. I can, uh, May the mist oh, protect Did he do it? He did it. Okay. All right. Slow down. Farmer Fung, a gift for Fung. All right. All I right. I go watch over you. And then when it comes to, uh, when it comes to Jogu there, uh, do I have, uh, do I have carrots for him? Uh, I have lots, don't I? Um, do I have sautéed carrot? I do, I do. So he's he's already has probably already given that to him. He doesn't like anything else but sautéed. Okay, so uh, all right. So let's see. I wonder what I can. What can I cook? By the way, is there anything I can cook? I can cook Valley stir fry. Hey, what, what do I need? Wild fowl beast and valley stir fry. I'll cook a couple of those. Okay, I got it. And uh, at least I did that. I got a few points there. And uh, uh, I don't really have any. None of these are high enough to get another whatever. Okay, jade witch brew. I have to make this jade squash. And witch berries. How do I get witch berries? Witch berries are sold by. I thought she had them here. Let me see. Doesn't she have the witch berries? Welcome. Supplies for cooking lessons. Maybe not. Does not have those. I hope okay. to see you again and... soon. Welcome. All right. Let's have a look here. I don't know, how many iron paw tokens do I have? You know, I probably should get this, like, for food and stuff. I'm kind of curious now to do that. Uh, the 32 slot cooking bag. Well, let's find out how useful that's going to be. I'll, I'll buy one. And, uh... He does not have those kind of ingredients. Okay, so Next I don't actually know how you how you get those. I'll have to see how that's done. And this probably will say if I let's see. Uh, Jade witch brew. Okay, witch berries. Where do you get them? Okie doke. Auction house has them. Sold by no known merchant. Okay. I do not recall about the witch bearings. So. All right. I guess that would be that for now. And uh, I don't know. I don't know where I'm going to get those from. Uh, but I have a portable refrigerator. Let me see. Uh, let me see how this works for me. Uh, let me put this in my regular backpack. So let's see. All right. In the regular backpack, I got the Grummel pack. The other three Explorer bags. Let me see what I've got here. Uh, which one has the one? Which is the one is the one that has the food in it? It's this one. Let's just that's number three. That's the middle one. Now I don't know if this will go in here. Might not. These items cannot be swapped. Okay, you can't just swap. Right. So you have to. Uh, right. I'm gonna pull these things out of here. So these are consumables. 
but they're general consumables, so they could be uh, All right. All right, now. Now I should be able to swap these out and uh right? All right. Oh, look, it loaded everything in there already. Except now uh hang on. So, if I just do that now, uh basically So I always like to have um, I always like to have one uh... this is pretty good though the cooking bag so it'll keep all the ingredients too so anything for like a thing and then so uh, the the trade goods it'll save but it won't uh, um, so I could you know I suppose I could uh... all right. So I don't know what if this is better or not. I should probably uh, hang on to this for now. Uh, I kind of want to swap these two around. I don't know, huh? And uh, so let me see what I got here. Grummel pack is there, and I think it still has it set for that's that's a nothing. Thank you, Mez Mezlefi. Now for the follow, appreciate it. And uh, I've got like something. Uh, what was I doing? I have no idea. Um, okay, so uh, nice that we have more more space in the backpack now. I really don't need to carry this bouncy ball anymore. There's no point in carrying this. Uh, Okie dokie, let me see. So where am I headed here in this grand scheme of things? Uh, yeah, I guess... Uh, so I got the 18 spl slot explorer pack, but I've got the cooking bag, which has... So the cooking bag can hold... Cooked and raw food. So that's pretty good. And everything automatically goes in it that will go in it. So that's good. I got like the way that works. All right. I guess I could send this to the to my panda character because I think she needs one bigger bag anyway. I think there's another bag she could use. I'll send it to her maybe, because maybe maybe we'll be playing the panda again. This cooking bag actually should make it more easy to sort things too. So it's probably a thing. Let me see. There is Zhao Zhang Zhang Zhu Yi, really. I was saying Zhang Zhu, but it's actually Zhang Zhu Yi. And uh that's her that's her very long and very, very pronounceable name. Uh and I'm just gonna go ahead and send her this bag. And then she can send her other bag back to the banker and you know She'll have some stuff. She'll have more room for stuff. All right, so uh, so let's see where are we at here now. It's it's sort of uh, uh man, forehead, right? <laughs> I don't know. It's not that prominent. I don't. 
the trolls have given me a my very first trolls they've given me a complex about it not really um i have no complex about the size of my forehead anyway uh um yeah so uh There's birds dropping from the sky. Someone's shooting at them. And, uh, okay, I guess, uh, I guess that's about it. I, I can, I have to, uh, I'll just see what else I can do then. Now I've done all that. Oh, wait, what's this then? Uh, oh, harvest the cabbages. That's just something I can't do till tomorrow. And then, monkeys, right? Be all about the monkeys on the cliff. See, that's the problem with putting your farm over here. It looks very nice and all that, but there's all these monkeys up there. You know? And, you know, I can't really do anything. I can't do anything too, too, uh... Is that a guy I have to get? That's the, that's the chief, really. I have to get him. So, let's see. I uh, wonder if I should have some carrots. Oh man, he's gonna see me. See me, I'm not stealthed. Yeah. Okay. Powerful throw, don't get knocked off the mountain. Okay, it didn't do much. What am I doing here? I'm like, oh, I see, I've got the wrong thing. Let's, let's hit him over the head or something, huh? All right, all right, I got it, and I got I got his. Uh, you know what else am I supposed to do? Oh, these are the good. These are the the these are the the, the goats. Okay, stag horns. I can get those. They have leather. Okay, so up here, stealth kitty. All right, AOE there. Work complete. I can't really, uh... All right, so I can, I can burn some ropes. You definitely burn some ropes, and these ropes are burning. Oh, I got that was that was green tea leaf action. Okay. All right. So uh, now what? Probably more burning of ropes. Is that that's really all I have to do up here is burn some ropes. That's not a rope, but I'm gonna pick it anyway. All right? 30 EXP for that, huh? Okay, so that's another rope. Where are there some more ropes here? Okay, that's not a rope. This is not a rope, but I'm picking I'm picking flowers, basically. All right, I'm I'm probably not in the I'm not in the rope area here. There's a rope. There's a rope here. Okay, I can burn that rope. I can burn this rope. All right? Okay. All right, so I'm heading down here. That's a that's a one of those things, but you have to have the quest to pick that. So, uh I guess that's it for now then. Huh? I just can go back here and and uh and go back to, uh...
All right. All right, Ella. Greetings. Oh, hello. You have to burn the ropes. Ella's face lights up. You did it for me? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. May your days bring you joy. Ella has a good heart. Okay, oh, let's hello. see what... Uh... Oh, hey, I'm like... Uh, I'm an acquaintance now. Do you like kitties? I love them. She loves kitties. She likes kites and shrimp dumplings. Farewell. Okay. And uh, tell me of your travels. Looking for meat? I've got plenty right here. Fatty goat steak. Yum yum yum. It sounds really good. I had goat once in a Jamaican no restaurant, but it had lots of little tiny bones in it. it was kind of a, a little bit of a pain. Like some goat stew, but it had, it had bones in it. And it was delicious. But it did have these tiny bones you had to look out for. Uh, and let's see, what else What else is there going on here? Is, is that everything? No, there's one more thing I have to turn in here. I guess to, uh, to uh, Farmer Yoon. Oh, right. Because Farmer Yoon. Okay, right. Uh... Okay, Greetings, Farmer Yoon, the Kunzen Hunter Chief, that's it. That's all there is, okay? I'm just happy the fellow farmers can rest Jeez, easy in the meantime. You know, Farmer Yoon is, is kind of a good egg. He's, he's uh, he, 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 he thinks of his neighbors and stuff. I think he's a good guy. He's a pretty good guy. They ought to let him in the Tillers uh, Union because, uh, or whatever it is called, the Tillers Guild or... The tillers, whatever it is, thing. And they ought to let him in that because, you know, he's always doing nice things. Um, he's a little lazy. It seems like I'm doing most of the work a lot of the time, but, you know, at least. At least he's thinking about it. You know, he's thinking, he's thinking ahead. And, you know, that's what I like about him. He did learn some things from his daddy and his granddad, so he did listen. May not be the best farmer in the world. Uh, I kind of feel bad that I'm not a, a, a Draenei character because that would be like, that would be perfect for uh, kind of the Green Acres meme thing. If there's a meme, there's not a meme, but there's like, it would be like a Green Acres kind of like homage. Is that the right word? Homage? I think. Uh, <clears throat> I'm just saying, well, you know, so, so, uh, this is like, this is like, uh, um, what, let's see. So what kind of time do we have? I, I really only want to do a, basically a two hour stream tonight. And because I, I don't think I had breakfast, I think I just got up and I had some errands and then I just didn't do anything after that. So let me see here. Uh, uh. I've got See if I want to do uh um armor and uh consumables and trade goods like that. I was gonna put more things in my main pack if I do that, but uh, oh wait, maybe not. I don't know, actually. I'm not sure about that. Uh, but... It'll, it should put, like, the mysterious things, like your hearthstone and some of these other things that don't go... I don't know. Actually, I don't... I guess a lot of these things will go in the top pack anyway. So whatever you have up there, it, no matter what you have, if I put... Like, if I change this to equipment, I think it will uh, still put those things up there, won't it? Yeah, it sure will. Sure will. So, uh, things go in the top pack. Uh, all right, so that's fine. I think that's okay, though. I got the Grummel pack. I'll put that on top because that, 
none of the extra catch-all stuff goes in there. Oh, wait. No, actually, if I unhide this bag, I bet you it'll go in there. Yeah, it sure will. Okay. But if you don't have this bag hidden, then... Yeah. It's okay, I guess. I could do that, too. So... Where am I headed here? I, I think I'm headed to... Uh, Tell me of your travels. Well, Travel I've got like the shards I could turn into the Klaxi guy. Maybe I should do that since I have it anyway. I'm not going to do those quests right now, but... Um... Yeah, I guess, uh, I guess it's a thing. Um... Cookie Monster, 86. Uh, yeah, Cookie, uh, I'm going to lurk in your channel and see if I'll see what you have to say, but, uh, I'll let him know. All right. Okay, so I'll do... Okay, let's see what he has. I'm just here for the dough? That's... Okay, Nightbot. TBH, I'm just here for the dough? What does that mean? Uh, okay. Okay. I will do it that way. That'll be good. And, uh, see what I got here. Uh, there's some kind of a thing here. I've got some kind of a... Thank you, someone thanked me. No problem. Uh, and, uh, so I'm here, like, I can, like, turn in this, uh, this thing here. I can give him these things. Seeds of Fear. Okay, you should be able to dispose of these properly, right? We are done. That's it. We are done here. Now, I'm going to, uh, now I'm going to go to the incursion. Speak. And go see Nat Pagel, I guess. Preserve the cycle. All right, I'll fly. Be great. Okay, now let's see. Uh. And thank you very much, Willie, for the follow. I guess I should be announcing those, right? I mean, that's, uh, I think that's proper protocol. I, I don't really know because, you know, I've, I've heard, like, shouting out to lurkers is not right or something. And, I you know, I don't know. Like, so, but, like, I don't know, like, how, like... Uh, I gotta start that over again. Let me see. If I start from this side. Start from. 
That worked. That worked, okay. Uh, the wrong button. I always push the wrong button. Here we go. Okay. And looks like I'm there. That's the wrong thing, isn't it? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Okie doke, I guess we're ready to do something here. Bagel related. Okay. Nothing with the monkey. Huskar guy. My attention. Yeah, now he remembers druids, so it probably doesn't shock him that I look like a bird. Oh my gosh, a talking bird. What's up? Unfortunately, we can't fish them up since our snap our hooks with their powerful jaws fishing spears Travel right. the wastes with okay. Care. okay hello okay one way to kill a shark oh throw a chum in the water and I gotta do the shark thing okay safe travels okay now this one this one you really gotta do right away chum in the water all right, let me see. Uh, shark jab, eye gouge, and then this is the uh, when they start shaking. Hold on. Okay. There's only one way to kill a shark, he says. Did I do it? I guess not. I feel like I didn't do it. Nah, I didn't do it. I, what, what did I do wrong? There's gonna be no shark here either, so I'm gonna have to, uh... I'm gonna have to, like, abandon this and take it again, right? Because there's not gonna be a shark in here. Alright. Alright, let me see here. Just, uh... Jumping the shark. Okay, gotta jump the shark. Definitely gotta jump the shark. What's so here we go. What's this? Okay. I don't know. I don't know what anything is. How are you? I'm a lamer. I suck. Okay. Uh Alright. See you later. There's a shark. Okay, let's jump the shark. I can hit hold on again, right? Is that the deal? I got it. Got it. Okay. Shark has been jumped. Okay, now. Spears, right? These spears do not fly true, evidently. Uh... They have powerful jaws. Work complete. That's work complete. Oh no, just just uh Oh I see they it, it's a self-aiming thing if I do it. 
All right. Well, that's interesting. Uh, I wonder if I, uh, I wonder if I can use this. I wonder if I can use these spears. I can. I can use them in fishy form. Alright. Okay. Alright, complete. Alright. And what else? There was it. Okay, I jumped the shark. And then I've got these things and I got the spear fishing. Oh, there's something else here, too. Mm -hmm. I didn't see this. Uh, abalone. Until next I don't think time. I've had this one before. Jagged abalone meat. I guess I could just turn these in, huh? So. Uh, what can I do for you? That was a huge shark. Color me impressed. Have a good one. Okay. All right. Fifteen fifty. Pretty good exp being over leveled here Man, and I... uh armored carp you betcha any luck with the spear yeah the spear was actually pretty good so we did the spear spear was fine rewards claim your reward what fishing skill that's it, it a gold. When you all right a little exp and now what now when it comes to the uh now Abalone, is this like, uh, is this a, uh, is this a swimming fishing quest or what? Or is this for fishing? I don't see him. I don't see him fly. I don't see him floating around in here unless they're down on the ground. Are these them? They are jagged abalone. Okay. All right, there's basically shells. I can do that. All right, and uh, Yeah, there's one over here. I see another one already. How many do I need? I need a bunch. I need nine. So I need a few more. There's one. And this can be done in fish form, so that's pretty good. Although a killer whale is not really a fish, but no. Still, what is that? A baby bluegill murloc? Oh, he, he, he came out of the he came out of the thing and he did his little map. Okay. Did he come out of the thing when I opened it? Popped out. Bluegill. Bluegill mer Merloc. But there's not Merlocs floating around in here normally. It's like no Merlocs really. Okay. So there was no fishing involved in today's quest here. I don't know if I should fish. We'll see. I guess if I have, since I have like, uh, all right. What do you need? Okay. See any sharks down there? I saw sharks. I did see sharks. Looks like you found plenty of abalone. Great job. White tiger okay. Watch over you. Looking down the docks. What is it? Oh. So, let's see, I got some kind of an achievement here. Uh, oh, complete all the angler's quests at least once, right? Okay, I've done it now. Abalone was the last one, I guess, that I hadn't done. So, it takes a while to get that. And, uh... And what else? Oh, I guess I've turned them all in. Right? Yeah. I've turned them all in so I could do some fishing, I guess. I could do some fishing with the hay. Water gliding, swim speed, and underwater breathing. I didn't know they gave that to me. That was cool. All right. Well, I guess I could fish here, couldn't I? Uh, 
I'm still using Seth's pole, you know. Whoops. Uh. All right. I'll sit here on the edge, do a little fishing. So that's fine. And a shout out goes to. Let's see who, who, who. Yeah, I kind of got this idea to. Uh, I got this kind of this idea with uh, Lurks. Um, I'm going to try it right now while I'm thinking of it. Uh, it's something with the. It's something with the bot. So if I. Um, uh, let me see how this works. I, I, I've, I've never checked this out. So with, uh, with custom commands on Nightbot, so you can kind of like, uh, I can set this to, here's my actions for this. Okay. So I can set this, uh, cooldown is set to 60 seconds okay and that's I've done that already I guess I, I must have been thinking about this already okay uh, All right, well, no, this is not going to work. So, alias song request. Like, so, alias, uh, so there's an alias. Um, the. Okay, I think I have to look at the variables and see what, like. All right, uh. All right, uh, first argument time, Steve. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure what's going on here. Uh, query string, full input that comes after the command with URL ending coding. League of Legends, last of them. Val evaluates JavaScript code. That's probably DJ Khalid. Okay. Count up. Count down. Channel. Battle log. Arguments. Okay. All right. So I could just try this and see, but I don't know. I think it's going to be passed. So I'm guessing that, uh, I'm guessing that if I like have in it, if I put this, this could be an alias, uh, but if I put uh, if I put YouTube in here, like, um, I don't know. Let me see. So I'm gonna do like call one command from another. So uh, let me hit lurk and see what happens. Okay. Yeah, it just calls that. So, uh, and so let's see. I want to, if I want to do that, so that bit pretty much gets rid of everything there, the argument wise. And, uh, 
Uh, I said, I really don't want to do that, I guess. I guess that does not work. I don't know. I have to think about it. I just realized that if one command calls more than one command... Uh, I don't know if one command can call more than one command. Let's see about that. Alias. You can't, like, make it call two commands, I don't think. And I didn't see anything in here. There's not a lot of... Um, you don't have, like, a lot of... Uh, so I could evaluate a JavaScript code and I could do things. Uh, but... Uh, Count, counts up, counts down. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything that would be useful for that. Uh, oh, hey, hey, quick draw. So, all right. Thank you for the lurk, quick draw. And, uh... Um, yeah, I was, uh, doing a... I was doing an experiment, um, with Night Nightbot to see if there were things I could do that were... Uh, there are some fancy things you could do with Nightbot, but I'm not gonna... I'm not going to do anything too fancy now with Nightbot. I think I'd probably use a different bot for that. I think that would be a better fix. Yeah. Yeah. Fishing. Riveting stuff. I'll type that, too, just in case he's not listening. I don't know. Uh, um, there's no way to tell, really, unless you're... Uh, but anyway... Uh, yeah, I got the chat up there. I think that's good because then I'll see, uh, I'll see like, uh, um, I'll see something. That's, I don't know. Maybe I should make that, like, that air, that thing bigger. Hang on a second. I'm gonna, I'm gonna check this out here. Maybe it needs to be bigger. Uh, like more square. I think a little less, uh, less crowded then, maybe. I'm thinking, possibly. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. I guess I'm just, uh, uh, <laughs> you love fishing. Especially in WoW, it's, it's very rewarding. Um, I'm looking for a rare fish. I'm looking for a rare fish that I can give to Nat Pagel here. And so... You know, I've never actually fished in real life. Uh, the closest I've ever come to it was I got my friend a Popeil Pocket Fisherman for like a Father's Day gift. And... Uh, because I knew his family, his sons were far away, and so, you know, he he's probably not going to hear from them, at least not on time. And, you know, I got him something for Father's Day, and it uh, seemed like a pocket fisherman would be a good thing. And, you know, that was not all that long ago, you know, maybe several, some number of years, but not ten years anyway. And I found it in a... In a, in a drugstore that had one of those as seen on TV things. And of course the Pope Heel Pocket Fisherman was like a thing from the 70s. You know, when the first like Ron Coast, even before the age of the infomercial, when, when Ron Pope Heel used to run those commercials for his things. And, uh, um, and one of them was the, the Pocket Fisherman. And it was just a little fishing rod that folded up and you could put it almost in your pocket. And, uh, and uh, I know Rob, he loves fishing, and I don't think, you know, he really thought it was going to be like a serious thing. But then when he looked at it, he is an engineer, I should say, that's another thing. And when he looked at it, he said, you know, 
as he was investigating. This thing is actually really well designed. <laughs> and, uh, you know, it stood the test of time. And evidently, people catch real, people catch fish with their pocket fishermen. It's a good, it's a, it's a good compact fishing thing. And you can actually uh, catch real fish with it. So, you know, that's good. And, uh, so I don't know if he ever fished with it subsequently, but he did, he was delighted by it. So, you know, that's something. And, uh, you know, I don't know. I don't have too much, like, uh, I don't have too much, uh, like, what am I trying to say? Like, like time left, I'm kind of going to go. I figure I'd just sit here and fish because I'm not going to do another daily hub and I'm not going to do more. I'm going to really, I'm going to really cut out for at around two hours and uh, take a, take a real break and eat something, maybe cook something good that I want. And, uh, uh, So, all right, so, uh, I don't know, I'm just fishing for stuff. I got a box of stuff here. Some stuff in there. And, uh... You know, and one of the reasons why WoW is always going to be a special thing to me is that it was kind of like a home away from home for a while. You know, when things weren't going so well for me, at least I had something to do. And, uh, you know, it was a way to not think about my my more worldly problems for a while. And, you know... Uh... I'm always going to have a soft spot of, you know, in my heart about WoW for, for just for that reason alone. And uh, it's it's a good it was a good thing for me all in all you know and uh, it helped it actually helped me to iron out a lot of things. It's a strange thing to say, but you know, I mean, it wasn't exactly the South Park experience for me. I mean, a little bit. I I I, I probably, but um, um, but you know, it's it's uh. It's a very expansive world, and uh, you know when you have a really good computer, it looks pretty good too. And you know, when, when you can turn things all the way up. <sighs> and you know, I usually run my streams. I bet you I can up my stream uh, thing. I should probably do that right now while I'm thinking of it because. Then, um, if it looks like my frame rate goes down, I think I have a low frame rate on my, when my WoW is not uh, in the foreground. I think I have like 10 frames or something. That's enough when you're actually not doing it. Well, let's see if I can up this puppy. Uh, I get it? I didn't get it in time. Uh, It's probably uh, it's probably the congestion on the server is already going down now because it's already you know past it's around around ten o'clock almost so it looks like yeah I wish I'd thought of that yesterday when I was playing with Skirmy uh, uh, because I had it on a real low bandwidth because it was right in prime time when I started but you know once it gets past uh, you know once it gets past eight or nine o'clock or you know nine o'clock especially. You know, you can start turning the bandwidth up. It's 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 usually all right. You can turn it up. I could max it out. You know, I can get. Well, I've I've gotten six thousand before, and that's what like all the pro streamers think you should stream at. But 
I don't know, I, I it's not really necessary because it looks just fine at 2000. Well, 20, 2160 is what I'm running. And that's with, with the, uh, with the sound. Fine. Oh, I got a Mimic Octopus. That's something, right? Hello. Okay. All right. I got something. I could get, if I kept going, I could maybe even get the, uh, the other one. Or if I get another Mimic Octopus, I suppose I could get, like, uh, I could save it for tomorrow. But, you know, I'm doing all this fishing and I got stuff I can cook now, so... It's okay. I've noticed that my sound, my monitor sound, can be a little delayed, but... Uh-oh. Saw a blip. Maybe 2000's a little aggressive for this time. Maybe I should wait till after 10. I don't know. It's not too bad. Maybe I should uh, dial it back a bit. Okay, see how that does. I dialed it back a couple hundred, but it's still acting like, uh, yeah. Okay. All right. I dialed it back to like 1640. That's what it was on before. I'm just afraid that later on when I stream, I'm going to forget that that's what it was at. You know, and I'll forget to turn it up because I'll be able to turn it up. I will be able to turn it up. That's the thing. And I don't know. Keeps going back into the green periodically, so I don't think I want to turn it down. Maybe I should. I don't know. Now I'm getting a little congested. Maybe it's getting busy right now. I don't know. Thanks for the lurk, problematics. I guess that's it for now. Let's uh, let's talk to Nat here. Need something? Give him a mimic octopus. Oh, there it is, camouflage octopus. Wow. All right. Safe travels. Pesky little trolls. He's talking about here. Okay, now. I guess, uh, what can I do here? I guess I can go back to, uh, or I, I guess I can hearth. It's easier. It's faster. And here we are. Okay, so, uh... Let's see what we got here. Oh, yeah, you know, she's, uh... She's got, a uh, A lot of stuff here. What did she get? She got some fresh-squeezed lemonade. 
some dark moon. She got a dark moon dog. Great for fishing. But uh, cheap beer. EBR, probably. You know. Or AB, ABR, Azeroth Blue Ribbon. Something. TBR, like Thunder Brew Blue Ribbon. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Anyway, we'll have one. We'll relax and do that. Anyway, let's see. So is there anything? Well, actually, we probably should, uh, she probably should go, uh, down here and, um, maybe, uh, she has some graves we could get rid of. Many, many wares. Okay, and I got this puppy. And uh Farewell, that's about it. And uh Fare thee well, friend of the Grummel. And uh <clears throat> she's got some gear pieces here too. Let's see. Um the plate piece uh learned. And a leather piece, oh, soul bound. So, let's learn. So, um, yeah, she can go. This piece can go get sold. And let me see what else I have for. I've got Kuiperite. What do you do with this? These are things you can make things with. I don't even know what to do with a lot of these things. And uh, um, exotic leather for sure. I don't know about Kuiperites, probably used in uh, Oh, it can be prospected. Okay, well that's fine, but it's not uh, uh all right. Wind wool, I don't really need, let's see. Yeah, I don't need that. And here's some herbs. I don't know. I can sell the, the I can sell the, no, the keystones are soul bound, are they? Is that right? Oh no, they're not. Okay. Well, that's a thing that I could do. Dark moon, fire water, what the hay. Maybe life spirit. Oh, that's soul bound. I can't do it. I, what I can do is sell that. Uh, all right, and that's that. I can sell these two things to this I guy. I have many lucky dudes. Uh, you like? Any lucky dudes? I like. Okay. Anyway, whoop. so there she can hang out there. And uh, I guess that'll be it for now. So, I'm gonna say goodbye to everyone. Maybe I should, I should make a whiter, right? Make it a little whiter, you know, I should put up a white window to make it be like, uh, Lamp's kind of over here, so like, see, I can illuminate this side of my face. I can put the this right in front. I can put it over here, and then it's kind of like the lamp is lighting you, you know, kind of thing. I don't know, but uh, anyway, I guess that's gonna be it though for now. I think that's gonna be it. Um, I'll, I'm sure I'll see you. I'm sure I'll see all y'all later, and uh, we'll just go ahead and go from there. This is a pretty lazy stream today, but it is at two hours now, so 2.06. And uh, I guess we'll go. So, bye-bye. See you soon. And now it says Stream of Consciousness with Curvy Kong.